in a rude shock for the cricketing world, Rudy Coerzen, the former South African umpire, who was part of the ICC's elite panel, has died at the age of 73. He died in a car accident while driving from Cape Town to dispatch in Eastern Cape in South Africa, where he lived with his family. His son Rudy Coerzen Jr. confirmed the news. He said his father went on a golf tournament with some of his friends and they were expected to come back on Monday, but it seems they decided to play another round of golf. So he and three other people who were travelling with him were killed in a head-on crash near Riversdale, South Africa. So strong was the impact that all four died on the spot, but the cause of the crash is not yet known. Rudy Coerzen was part of the ICC's elite panel of umpires for eight long years, from 2002 until his retirement in 2010. And now, along with Pakistan's Alim Dar and West Indies' Steve Buckner, Rudy was one of the three empires to stand in over 100 test matches. At the age of 43, Rudy's first international series was India's tour of South Africa in 1992. His first game was the second ODI in Port Elizabeth. He went on to become one of the best and most well-respected umpires in the world and won praise in September 1999 for refusing a bribe to manipulate a match between West Indies and India in Singapore. The 2007 World Cup final, however, was a blip in his career. Rudy was the third umpire in the match in Barbados, where the officials came in for criticism and were penalised by the ICC following a chaotic finish to the game. After retiring as an international umpire in 2010, he published a book as well, which was called Slow Death, Memoirs of a Cricket Umpire with Chris Schumann. In this book, he addressed the 2007 World Cup final. Rudy Coulson went by the nickname Slow Death because of the amount of time he took to raise his finger while giving a batter out. The last rep game that Rudy stood in was in 2011, an IPL match between Royal Challengers Bangalore and Chennai Super Kings in Bangalore. At the time of his death, he was still umpiring a few games in his hometown in South Africa. In his youth, Rudy played club cricket in Kimberley and was a medium pacer before becoming a professional umpire. He worked for the railways as a carpenter in Port Elizabeth. Then he worked in the civil engineering department, supervising new buildings and renovations. He worked for them for 28 years and was a semi-professional umpire until 1993. Of course, the who's who of the cricketing world have paid their respects to the legendary umpire on Twitter. You can leave your thoughts, prayers and anything that you want to say in the comment section as well. Like, share, subscribe, hit the bell icon. And follow us on Twitter and on Instagram. It's at the rate review Ron. We can connect there, chat there. I'm also available on Twitter as at the rate Ron Akoteja. But as always, even if you don't do any of these things, thank you so much for watching this one. Please take care of yourself and those around you. Jai Hind.